Life throws us daily challenges. Living with depression or anxiety can strip us of our joy. At Spiritlift, our goal is to provide helpful insight to make your life's journey easier. Welcome to Spiritlift, a journey to a better you. As part of your course, you have a part of it that is uh, labeled the relax and start in neutral you know, theme yes. of your course. So is yes. to, to really get in the right state of being, the right state of mind to have like this access internally that we're talking about, it, does everything have to start with that? Is the relaxation part of it? That's the that's a that's a key part of it. Um, the course, I'd say, if people do one part of the course only, that that's the main part to do because people think of positive thinking, and the book does get into positive thinking. However, most of our thoughts are negative already, and people think well to cure the negative thoughts. The antidote to negative thoughts is positive thoughts. The problem is that. It's almost impossible to control our thoughts fully. Controlling our bodies is easier. If I say lift my hand up, it goes up, go down, it goes down. If I tell you don't think about a red monkey, you just thought about a red monkey, you couldn't help it. So the antidote to negative thinking is actually just to chill out and relax. And when you just relax, we induce the relaxation response, the positive thoughts, these happy thoughts arise spontaneously. And at a lower level, at a biochemical level, what happens is, when your body's stressed out, and we're, we're all too stressed out nowadays, um, when your body's stressed out, things like the digestive system are suppressed. So you can't extract, even if you eat the healthiest food and green smoothies and all that stuff, if you're stressed out, your body's not absorbing it as much as it should. You're also, your immune system is being basically suppressed. And the reason is simple, Devin, it's that, um, the fight or flight response, if you're being attacked by a wild tiger, a saber toothed tiger, it's not good for your body to waste energy fighting that tiger. I mean, sorry, it's not good for your body to waste energy um, fighting an infection or digesting food. So all the energy is diverted towards the muscles to make you run or fight. And then when you relax, you no longer need to fight the tiger. There's no need to send extra uh, energy, extra blood to the skeletal muscles to make you run or fight. Then you can relax and your body spontaneously, the immune system gets a little boost. The digestive system starts to work, which is why the relaxation response is sometimes called the feed and breed response, because the same thing applies to romant ro romantic stuff. You gotta, I don't know what your audience is, if I should use the, the different terms or not, but I mean, let's say you're having a, a hot date and all of a sudden you get scared by, by, by a wolf. You're not thinking about your, you know, you're not thinking romantic thoughts anymore. You're thinking, how can I protect my <laughs> the person I'm with and then run? So this is why starting in neutral is so important. And it's a, it kind of busts a myth, Devin, a myth. The myth is that um, positive thinking is the antidote to negative thinking. Positive thinking is, first of all, it's almost impossible to do right unless you're relaxed. And relaxation on its own spontaneously generates positive feelings. So the relaxation response is, is a key part of the whole course. And it, it's all explained, you know, I, I provide all the evidence and so on if people are interested. And the book gives you concrete tools for how to activate this relaxation response, as it's called, in literally no time at all. And how do I do it in no time at all? It's not magic. Well, because some tools you can use while you're doing other stuff. So there's a breathing technique I teach where you just slow down your breath in a very specific way. And you can do that while you're working. You can do it right now while you're listening to me. Um, and some other tools only take a minute. So it gives you some concrete tools you can use immediately. Of course, it's better to do it for longer. And I also provide um, information about how to do it for longer. And I've got some detailed information about that. And, but it's, it's like exercise. If you do exercise even a little bit, it's better than nothing. But if you wanna get very good at it, you gotta do more. So the same thing with activating or inducing the relaxation response. I provide tools to pe for people they can do right away while they're at work, while they're taking a one minute break and also open the door for them to pursue longer um, exercises should they have time and want to put it into their schedules.
I think that's what's so important about your particular course is that, you know, because people in general feel like they have no time. They're, you know, they usually approach um, ways to feel better about themselves or want to get better for themselves when they've already accumulated, uh, you know, a ton of time and energy of being already in a situation of depression or of anxiety, right? It's so they, they go up and up and up a mountain of, you know, a, a huge mountain that is depressive related or anxiety related. And then they're like, okay, I'm about to crack. I'm about to fall. I'm about to collapse. I need something now, right? So yeah, that is not the best way to approach getting better. But what I like, what you do with your courses, like say, you know, for those people who are at the top of the mountain, you know, and just totally strung out on different issues, right? And then at the same time, they have no time for this thing. They have no energy for this thing. They're distracted by this thing. What's good about your course, I feel, and I think people really benefit from it is that, like you said, Ray, if you don't, if you want to incorporate small bits of it and try it out, in a short amount of time in, in a break here or when you wake up in the morning here or this time of your day here, you do it little by little incrementally, see the changes that occur. And then you're going to naturally make space and want to make space to really get into it in a more fully fledged way that will have a, you know, a longer, deeper impact for you. Wouldn't you say? That's exactly right. So the course is designed for busy people like you and me. I know what it's like to be busy. I got, Two young kids. I got one kid turned one a week and a half ago. Another one's two and a half. Congratulations. Um, thank you. It's wonderful, but it's, um, you know, you know, I don't get enough sleep. I often don't get enough sleep. I've got to work. I've got to, you know, pick the kids up from nursery sometimes, help out and all that stuff. And so I barely have time. So this is the kind of thing that I could use. I mean, of course, this is my job. So I, I do it maybe more than most people, but the course is just, it's quick. It's like, you got to a three, so a three to five minute video per week. That's nothing. You can do that while you're brushing your teeth. And the exercises, quick. Some of them take no time at all, um, but they're powerful. They're based on a wide body of evidence. So think of the, the course at the tip of the iceberg where I've done everything under the iceberg for you, prepared it, digested it. And then I present you with just a tip so you could just see, you know, a three to five minute video I think only one of them is longer than that. It adds up to you know, 30 seconds a day, short exercises, little nuggets you can use right away. And you spoke about accumulating the benefits. The benefits can be felt immediately. Just taking one deep, slow breath will make you feel better straight away. It changes your whole biochemistry.